Hey everybody, this is Jordan here. Um, this will be my first episode of um, taking a test drive with Jordan. So right now I'm in a 21 Jeep Wrangler. Now why I wanted to do this one first, first episode was because Jeep Wranglers are, they drive a little bit different than everything else. It's definitely something you have to experience. My suggestion is always, if you're interested in a Jeep Wrangler, take one for a drive. They drive like nothing else. Um, so yeah, I wanted to take this drive. Just want to address you you guys before I get going on the drive. I have the vehicle running, I have a Willys. So, but yeah, I'm just going to get on the road and then tell you what I think as I go. Okay, so when you get in a Wrangler, one of the first things that you're gonna notice is how upright and rugged these things feel. So what that means, is you uh and this is a willy so this isn't uh doesn't have the heaviest suspension like a rubicon would but very you basically feel every single bump so and the reason for that is this is an off-road suspension it also has the solid front and rear axles this thing is built for off-road this thing is a mate like the whole thing is made for off-roading and that's what it's amazing at it comes from the factory that's like that so it's not the smoothest ride, but it's, uh, yeah, it's not the smoothest ride, but, uh, you know, some people love it. It's absolutely what they're after. Um, so this one I have here has your 3.6 Pentastar motor. It's got, it's got decent power for Wrangler, you know, keep in mind, this is a bigger, heavier SUV. Um, she picks up and goes, you can also get the two liter. What I noticed between the two liter and the 3.6 is the two liter tends to have a little bit more, a um, little bit more torque going around town on the highway. I find the very much the same, but that's pretty typical for a direct injection motor that's turbocharged. They have about the same horsepower, same torque. You're gonna get a little bit better fuel economy with the two liter, but this V6 is tried and true. So, as you can see, my phone is bouncing around. That's me going over um, some bumps and that type of stuff. This one also has a um, more aggressive tire on it, so that makes it different. But I'm just going to turn everything off so that you can hear the road noise. But yeah, so transmission shifts beautifully. Um, I actually really like the way this vehicle drives. Um, it's a little bit more rough, but if that's something you like, that's something you like. Um, and then I feel very upright. I feel high on the road. I have great visibility um, of everything because I'm so upright, which I really like. And it just feels like the best part about this vehicle is I feel like I can go anywhere. It's not super big, it's light, or it's not light, but it, it feels really light, it feels really nimble. I don't notice a big difference between this SUV and I have a Jeep Cherokee Trailhawk and like how light it feels and how nimble it feels. It's just this, I feel like I have way more capability. Like if I go mount to curb, that's not a problem. Um, and then one thing I do notice is, because I just took a turn back there, it's quite a bit body roll, which you would expect for an SUV like this. But my biggest thing is this thing is just a little bit more rough than your average vehicle um, because of the axles, because of the suspension, because this is set up to be an off-road vehicle. Um, that's kind of my biggest thing with this vehicle, so. Now stereo, this one has the upgraded Alpine system. I think it's a wonderful system. I absolutely love it. Even the standard six speaker system that you get in Jeeps is beautiful. I find that uh, all of our all of our sound systems sound amazing, but I absolutely love it. It's um the Alpine is something that I really love. I find it kicks really well. You you um EQ it up just right, it sounds amazing. Some of the best. I sometimes prefer it over the upgraded Harden Carmen system, believe it or not, so. But yeah, tons of body roll, definitely a lot. You feel a lot of bumps. 
um, with the more aggressive tires, you can hear them, you can feel them. Um, but all in all, I really love the way this vehicle is. Your Uconnect system, super easy to use. Um, your digital display in the center, also super easy to use. Um, it's got everything I need, it's right there. I'm just driving, so I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of the interior so you can take a look at that too. But I just, I love the way this vehicle drives. So I'm just stopped, so here's your uh, gauge cluster, super easy to use, just on the left-hand side of the steering wheel. You have your speed, super easy to flip between miles per hour, kilometers per hour. Here's all your info, it's just right there. Um, here's a couple of little features, like your uh, steering angle, and then we'll also give you your pitch and roll. This is more for off-roading, fuel economy, trip info, stop start. And then I always really like the screen setup. You can change what's all up in your corners there. So really nice that way. Let's put outside temperature. Super nice. And then your Uconnect screen I find is super easy to use. Um, if you want climate, there's your climate. You also have buttons down there. If you want your navigation, you click there. Your phone, you click there. Radio, all the fun stuff is all right there. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed taking a test drive with Jordan. This is a 21 Wrangler Willys. Um, I'm going to start doing so. If you want me to take some vehicles for a test drive, give me a shout. Um, let me know which ones you want. My number is 204-572-5835. Thank you so much, guys.